What's up, everyone? My name is Alan, founder and consultant at Fernand Marketing, and welcome to day one of Brazemus 2023. For the next 25 days, including today, December 1st, we will be posting one Braze YouTube video every single day. Your feedback will be extremely helpful throughout this opportunity, so please keep an eye out for a paid feedback opportunity. And I'm super excited to share my Braze experience with you all, starting with what is Braze? Well, some people call it an ESP, email service provider. Braze can certainly send emails, but that wouldn't be a fair description because Braze can do way more than just send email. I've also heard it called MAP, Marketing Automation Platform. Yes, Braze is definitely the tool for marketing automation, but this still doesn't provide a full picture of what Braze can do. Many CRM teams or customer relationship management teams use Braze as their main tool. We're getting close, but I think there's a slightly better, more active term for what Braze is. Braze calls themselves a customer engagement platform right here on their landing page, and they power customer-centric interactions between consumers and brands in real time. I'm not sure if CEP is a widely adopted acronym, as if we need more acronyms in today's tech space, but Braze is a customer engagement platform that allows brands to engage with their consumers or end users at every step of the user journey. And Braze can do this through seven different channels. We have mobile and web push. Push notifications are an absolutely necessary channel in today's marketing world. And Braze is an industry leader when it comes to push notifications. It's really cool to see the specific capabilities that Braze offers for iOS, Android, and web push individually, which we will dive into deeper in future videos. We have in-app and in-browser messaging. Never did the marketing teams have more control of their product until they met Braze as in-app and in-browser messages. And this channel just keeps getting better and more robust. Third, we have content cards. It's the cool channel that everyone wants to launch because you can populate banners, carousels, notification pages, and so much more. It is an add-on channel and it will require some product design and engineering resources, but all the effort is super worth it. Fourth, we have email. Email is not dead. A traditional classic marketing channel that is absolutely necessary for marketing operations and Braze does it very well. Fifth, we have SMS, a very powerful channel with a super high open rate. When's the last time you didn't open an SMS that was sent to your phone? Six, we have WhatsApp. Braze's newest channel allows brands to build real-time two-way messaging with their consumers. Seventh, audience sync. Improve the efficiency of your paid media efforts with this Canvas step. For a bonus and my personal favorite, webhooks, providing a ton of technical flexibility within the Braze dashboard. And those are all the channels available in Braze for brands to engage with their consumers. That's it for day one. If you have any questions, please share them in the comments. We're happy to help. If you learned something from this video, please subscribe for more awesome Braze videos in the future. Thank you for watching and see you next time.